My ex is pregnant. Hey, <laughs> shit, they got serious, man. What's, What's good, good then, them gang? Man? It's your boy D Man. It's your girl Maya. And, and we, we back, back with another little video. video. So listen, man. Listen, listen, listen. What's good, uh, YouTube? You know what I'm saying? What's good to the gang? Y'all finally get to see her back on the channel, man. We're gonna do a little live QA. Uh, back, y'all. Fast. I got some questions right here, or whatever. We're gonna get into it. But before we get into the video, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure y'all turn on post notifications for everything that we drop. And if you ain't watched the last video, make sure y'all go do that. I also got a little personal vlog coming out for y'all. But you know what I'm saying? We're in the car with it. That way y'all know it's a car video and it's a banger, you know what I'm saying? So listen, we finna get right into the Q&A. We ain't gonna hold y'all up no longer. And bam, let's get into it. And here we go. Alright, so basically, let me see. It's a, hold on, the first question is, would we say we had positive progression in our relationship since we've been together? Right, you answer first. Like, do you think we, you know, been doing on the positive route, not in the negative? What you think? Yes, we have been on the positive route. It has been a little some bad days. Uh, let's just say long distance is not for the week. I promise y'all. Especially not when y'all been with each other literally every day to going to not seeing each other at least like Absolutely. just a weekend. So Yeah. That's that's like the real hard part of it. And it's really just attachment issues and it just costs. But know, yeah. I would say issue. that we have positive progression. Um I don't think in a relationship, if y'all together it should go downwards. Mm -hmm. Um, it always should be positive and if it's going down constantly y'all need to work on something get counseling or just not be together you know sometimes it's better not to be together yeah. or you know if y'all break up and fix yourself while y'all are like single and if y'all know y'all meant to be y'all will get back together yeah so second question um what do we think caused the most arguments in a relationship all right i'll go so basically what i think caused the most arguments in relationship is jealousy um jealousy <laughs> my bad y'all jealousy causes the most arguments i'm not gonna cap to you um if you if if and then i'm, I'm not saying like jealous of your significant other but what your significant other does with other people is what can cause arguments that's just that's just what i think more than anything that's definitely like the main factor of it <clears throat> um how many kids do we want all right y'all we bad my bad the camera had cut off y'all see we in new outfits or whatever but um it's a new night we've been instacarting all day so we ain't had no we ain't have a chance to do it yet but we back at it though we back at it well y'all was asking how many kids do we want so how many you can go first i want two two or three what what did you what she want two or three two or three is boring like i'm i'm trying to see like how about a star in love up in a six man oh you don't you don't think that's a good idea you don't think that's a good idea six kids babe yeah six six you saying it like it's gonna change my mind six Ooh, like Y'all come how many kids y'all might want. Six is good. Like, y'all gotta think about it. Especially if y'all have, like, like y'all got, like, three boys and three girls, and they, like, in between each other. But who that's said lit. that's gonna happen? It, we ain't gonna say it, but it's gonna happen, but it's, like, it's a possibility. So, you know, taking it into consideration. And with the oldest gotta be a boy. Yeah. The, I would prefer the two oldest to two oldest to be a boy. And the be youngest boys. can be a girl. Yeah, and the youngest could be a girl because you know how boys is over there. It's female siblings. If y'all protective over y'all siblings, y'all let me know. I, I know it is. Um, <laughs> this question is crazy. This question, okay, this is, have we ever ate 
a lollipop off the carpet. I haven't. You you never ate a lollipop off the carpet. So you telling me? <laughs> you telling me at your grandma's house, she done gave you a dum dum, and you drop it, and you don't ever pick it up and eat it. I don't remember doing it when I was little. She probably have, but it's just no way that um that you never ate a lot of both. Bro, I, I feel like everybody have done that once, at least once in your life. You ate a lot of pop out the carpet. You just had to. It was an experience. What's like the weirdest thing you ever ate? The weirdest thing I ever ate. What is the weirdest thing I ever ate? Mine was like a piece of leaf. You out there eating leaves off the ground? <laughs> Y'all, she had to think she eat spinach. <laughs> like she, she eat leaves off the ground, man. That is crazy. It was a piece of leaf, y'all. I don't nah. I don't know what was going on with me at that time. Leaves off the ground is crazy. Yeah, I'm not really I don't really eat crazy. like I don't I don't really eat crazy stuff like Me either, but I don't know. I don't know. What's your favorite like if you had to go to a Mexican restaurant, what'd you order? Y'all, them birria tacos. I gotta try it again. Cause last time when I tried it at the food truck, I ain't really like it. But the way I've been seeing on TikTok, I need to redeem myself. Man, what the hell, bro? That shit is crazy. Nah, they wildin'. Yo, you for real? You is serious right now? What you talking about? Nah, you gotta be kidding me, bro. This, you gotta be kidding me. What are you talking about? Nah, hold on, hold on, bro. Man, what? What happened? Why are you so mad? Cause you, this shit is crazy. What's crazy? Like, this shit is crazy. What is crazy? My ex is pregnant. <laughs> she done got serious, man. Like, you mad? Bro, like, this is crazy. And you mad? She got pregnant by somebody, like, by somebody that's some random dude. And you mad? What you mean? That that really bothered you. It's just like, it's crazy though, like, I'm not saying that I wanted to get her pregnant, but it's like. That's what it's giving. No, I'm not saying that, but it's like, bro, she's pregnant by another dude. It's crazy, like, you moved on like that. Like, that is crazy. Bitch, you did the same thing. But you moved on. You not pregnant. She is. So you You're not pregnant. pregnant so she you, is. So, so you mad that she pregnant by another dude. That's not. And it's listen, not you. Listen. You talking about she moved on like that. You want to play stepdaddy? That's what, what you want to do? Fuck, bro. Nigga, this don't play with me. You want to play stepdaddy? That's Can what you, you want to do? quit jacking me up for real? Like, please, quit jacking me up, bro. Quit jacking me up, bro. No. Because that shit, that's crazy. Like, I want to never thought that would have happened. Chill. Because you crazy. Chill. We still got to get back into the video and shit. But that shit. You like, crazy. Nigga, you playing. But can you believe she's pregnant? Bitch, I don't give a fuck. Like, bro. This is, this is wild to me. Like, this is, this is really her baby. Like, this is really her baby. Man, I don't know that shit, bro. Like, what the You really mad that your ex is pregnant. Bro, my ex is really pregnant, though. When you moved on, you moved on as well. Seems to me like you still want her. It's not about wanting her. It's just that she's pregnant. What are you not understanding? Like, that that's not crazy to you? She moved on from me and get pregnant. I can't believe this. I still can't believe how you mad at her for getting pregnant. When you moved on, it's not really looking like you moved on. You can move on physically, but mentally it's like, bro, how? Why did she get pregnant? So if you not moved on mentally, why did you get another relationship? That's not you asking me questions. On it's not time for questions. It's time for why did she get pregnant? It's time for you need to not be mad about it. It seems like you want that to be your baby. It ain't that. I'm just saying this shit crazy. Like you want that to be your baby. I ain't never say that. Alright, bro, just look at this shit, bro. She's literally fucking pregnant. 
and I literally don't care. Like she's literally pregnant, bro. Like so, look me, crazy. look me in my face and tell me that you mad that yeah, she's pregnant. She's pregnant. Yeah, it's, it's not nothing else to say about it. Like that's all I'm saying. Like literally, the proof is right here, which is crazy. I I really don't care about her being pregnant. I really Trip. don't. Tripping. That's all I don't need. You know what? You don't I need this phone no more. I'm just gonna throw it out. Throw out, throw what out? I'm just gonna throw your phone out. Mm, all right, play with it. All right. What are you doing? I'm finna throw it out. Man, you mad about your? Man, you mad about out. your ex being pregnant? I'm finna throw it out. Watch me. Right. Bro. Bro, let me tell you something right now. Bro, this shit was just a prank. And then you wildin' like trying to throw my phone out the window and shit is crazy. Throwing my phone out the window is crazy, dog. I would never throw your phone out the window. Like, I. That's... Why would you play like that? What you mean? Why would I play like that? Like, nigga, your big head ass in the camera. Pranking her ass and shit. Yo, y'all don't know what that vibe is, man. You know what I'm saying? Bang, bang, bang. Nigga, Team D Man in the comments, man. Y'all know how we rock. Yeah, that part. Y'all know how we do it. She took an L. I took a W. She just mad because my ass pregnant. Like, that's crazy, right? I'll kill you. I'll kill you is crazy too. I would never say that. No but man, if y'all mess with a prank, man, get into it and like, comment, and subscribe. If y'all don't come to D man, y'all are ills. For real, for real. I promise you, y'all are ills. Because y'all gotta pick a side. Y'all can't be neutral. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gotta be my side or her side. I know gang got me. I know gang got me. Y'all come at Team D man, man. But listen, we're gonna get that child with another one, man. We out. Ha. Demon time, nigga.